This video is another in the series of working with RecForge 2 Pro. Now in this one what we're looking at is the user's backing track and swipe feature. So what that means is let's have a look at uh, one I've recorded earlier and we'll play it. And then I will hit pause if not stop on the top right. Now if I press top right you'll see it says share conversion metadata etc what it does not say is users backing track so if I put my finger on the tablet here in the blue bar at the top center and I drag down you'll notice it reveals in the background the list of audio tracks notice top left green is highlighted now that's the one I've just listened to if I hit the top right menu bar what you'll see is use as backing track. Now, when I click this in just a second, this will play out of the speakers, but also I will record my voice over the top. Now, two options there, plug in a headset, listen to the clock ticking, but only record your voice, or let the sound come out into the speakers, and then the microphone will pick up my voice and the clock. Now, I will demonstrate this now. What you hear is the clicking of a tock, a clock. I can't even speak. Oops. Now you'll notice that I've made a mistake there, that's fine, but also I've recorded one track over the top of uh, the clock ticking. Now I'm just gonna save it as clock voice and click OK. Now let's listen back to what we've actually recorded. Go and find it, clock voice, there it is, play. What you hear is the clicking of a tock, a clock. I can't even speak. Oops. Okay, so now let's do that in a second variation, and I'm going to go back. Remember, I'm going to look for the clock file, which is that one. Top right, still not there. Doesn't matter, sometimes it's there. My point is that slide down, use. Now, this time, before I hit use backing track, I'm going to plug in wherever it's gone. A headset so no sound will be coming out of the speakers and therefore my voice only will be coming into the microphone watch I am hearing the ticking of a clock in my ears and this is a voice over the top now let's play that back I am hearing the ticking of a clock in my ears, and this is a voice over the top. Now you'll notice it sounds pretty odd because there is no clock in there, of course there isn't. Now, then I can go back with a previous feature, and I can merge those two to make one audio track. So if you're with me so far, what we're actually talking about here is the clock voice, and also the clock to edit those as a merge. Now, why should you bother doing that? Isn't it tricky? Well, it might be, but look at the outcome. Let me play you a file, which I recorded by accident, actually, um, and it is this one about a fighter plane. Now, as a precursor, I was in a field just practicing using uh, another audio app on an Android phone, and then out of nowhere, a World War II fighter plane literally came over my head in the field, which was a fantastic thing. Listen to my voice at the start, and on this clip you'll see and hear that the microphone cannot handle my voice at one moment because it's auto-shifting, but you've got a fantastic pop of the fighter plane engine as it goes past. The issue being that my microphone could not pick up my voice in close range, and also a fighter jet uh, with the propeller and the engine overhead. So that's why you might want to record two different audio tracks to get a really good result. Let's just let, play the clip. The fantastic sight of a single propeller, vintage. Listen. Now that's that's the clip. Now. I might provide in the uh, the post editor of this video the actual proper clip, but you can hear it a lot better. But I'm just going to play the start of it and listen to the word where I say fantastic, and it really pops the microphone too heavy. Listen. The fantastic sight. Oh, that's nasty, isn't it? You listen again. 
fantastic it just pops the microphone and it's far far too heavy so if you're using multiple clips my tip is really get used to using um, everything you can on this app because uh, I, I think it's very very useful but like anything in life practice makes perfect